We're gonna have a heated discussion. Things for you. People joke, say those Varun zealots worship a snake. Picked up something you might be interested in. Welcome to Slayton Aerospace. Can I help you? Need to make an appointment to see Nicholas Slayton. I'm afraid Mr. Slayton is a very busy man. I'm sure he'll understand. We've had a slight mis misunderstanding. Arguments with Miss. Yeah, alright. He's expecting me. No, he isn't. I've got Walter Stroud with me, CEO of Stroud Eklund. We weren't expecting a VIP to come through today. Let me just run a few checks. Thank you. Oh, I think we can make an exception in your case. Mr. Slayton will see you. Just use the elevator. Hoping to get a meeting? I've been waiting all day. See, we can see, old man. Wait, this clearly isn't the executive level. He's on to us. Walter, uh, <coughs> taking what's mine, then breaking into my office. A bold move, but one easily countered. Oh, we're trapped. Hello, Walter, dear, are you there? Yes, sir. Took longer than I'd like, but I managed to pay off one of Slayton's security consultants. They've patched me in. Nice. All right. We've got her out. Once the door's open, just follow her instructions, okay? Copy that. I'm aware of the irony of me continuing to say it'll be easy. <laughs> but it'll be easy. Doors will open in three, two, one. Sun's out, Slayton guns out. Guns and employees are all over. Be careful. Okay. You'll want to use the vent system to slip around unnoticed. There's a cover just to the right of the elevator you came in on. That's the elevator you came in on. Jump right across the top of it, and keep going to the end. Okay. Drop down and follow the conduit all the way to the end, past the fork. There's a vent above you. Just climb up. Okay. Now what? The room below you is clear. Drop down. You're going to be carrying that gooey mess. All right. One of the doors leads you right into the open. I'm unlocking a safe route. Opening the door on your right. Go now. Well, I would go now. Hold up. Let's quick save. Head left. But don't go through the door at the end yet. There's a robot stalking the hall. Okay. Wait. It's walking down the hall. Copy that. Go now, to Jaws, to the door. Keep going all the way to the end. Let me just 
to get that for you. Security is on the Nope, I'm reloading. I missed I messed something up. We can definitely shoot our way out if we need to, but I would prefer to keep the sneak thing all the way through if I can. Head left, but don't go through the door at the end yet. There's a robot stalking the hall. Wait. It's walking down the hall. Go now to your heart through the door. Going all the way to the end. All the way to the end. Which is here. Wait, there's people in the room up ahead. Closing the shutters. What Another robot shot up ahead. Is she talking Wait about? for it to pass, then head straight across to the maintenance door next to the security gate. Maintenance door Let next to the get that for you. Oh, this door. That's what I missed. You know the routine. Up the vent. It's a short one, I promise. Okay. We just drop it straight back down. Almost there. Door on the right. This door. There's the door. It should take you outside. Outside? You expect us to climb up the trade tower? There's a series of catwalks that lead directly up one floor to the executive level. Well. I guess after you. All right. Intense, man. Coffee's kicking in too, which is good. Chris is rocking out to some Irish. Thank you when you have a moment. Folk music. You can hear it bleeding in from the kitchen. Let's do this. No, that's why I just loaded. We're going to load that. I don't know if I can sneak past them or not. I'll be right back.
All right, let's see if we can keep our sneak status on the way out of here. Oop, oop, somebody saw me. Off. Ah. Come on, Strauss. I did quick save before we ran into those guys so if that ends up being an issue with quest progression I'll go back and see if we can't sneak it Unfortunately, if they're still all, all on alert on the inside now, I'm going to want to redo it. Oh, we're going to confront him now. Dude, you guys just tried to shoot me. I'm You're not going to have any mercy. You're behind the executive elevators. I will call the one on the far end, and you can walk right over the top. You know, it's moments like this that really makes Neon the best place to do business. You steal what's mine. I trap you in the city. You infiltrate my office. I lock it down. Where else can you match wits for the highest stakes but here? This guy sounds like the Emperor from um, the Fallen Empire, Star Wars Yoda Public. Uh, what is his name? The father of the twins. Through those two expansions in the in the Star Wars Old Republic, it sounds like the same voice actor. Call off your guards, Slayton, and release my ship. You have what's mine. I indirectly have what's yours. We are at a stalemate. Although I do count a few more guns on my side. It's not gonna help you, bro. I wouldn't trust your mercs. They haven't stopped us so far. Hmm. You do make a bold point. I'm carrying, yeah, yeah, but that yeah. That doesn't that guy. resolve our current dilemma. Perhaps I can help. We're both people of business, Nicholas, in the same industry, no less. Yes, I'm beginning to see the opportunity. There is, however, one final detail to disclose. Mr. Musgrove, my former employee, and the thief responsible for our serendipitous meeting was caught prior to your arrival. I think it would cement our new partnership if you were to decide on his sentence yourselves. Let him go. If you wish, you will have the opportunity to tell him yourself shortly. He's a thief and you're going to let him go. That's preposterous. My security brought Musgrove to my office. I'm sure seeing you again will be a fine conclusion to your previous business. We have an opportunity to spare a man's life. I know he probably wouldn't do the same for us, but that shouldn't matter. We should just let him go. No sense in more violence. Oh, no. You. 
Slayton really does have a sick sense of humor. Why'd you steal the artifact? I want the whole story. Ten years working in aerospace engineering, and they laid me off. You're damn right I stole that thing. They tell you if you have talent and commitment, you can go far. But the truth is, it's all about who steals the most and gets away with it. If you don't cheat, you don't win. Please, I was just trying to sell a product, okay? Isn't that why we're all here? Be lenient. We were taking advantage of his initiative, after all, even if we have found ourselves working with the man he stole from. Get out of neon while you can. I... Thank you. You have no idea how lucky you are, Musgrove. If it was up to me, I'd have fed you to the wolves. A rare moment of compassion for this city. Very well. I'll clear things up with the authorities. You're free to go. Time to go. Let's talk more back at the ship. I kind of feel like I should have just iced this dude. Can I reload real quick? Just to see what the other outcome would be. Why not? Second playthrough. We got things to see. Yeah, none of that made sense to me. Like, that was, like, we went from having a confrontation with the guy well, to him suddenly just offering us a thief, and I'm like, what? I'll call the one on the far end, and you can walk right over the top. You know, it's moments like, have a moment. you steal what's mine. Yeah, cross the wrong person. Ah, it seems you have chosen more violence. Very well. There he is. Oh. Do I got a turret all of a sudden? Oh shit, we got a whole bunch of dudes. Oh, is he fucking running? Come out, buddy. Let's do this. Oh, check it through the door. There we go. Did we get him. did now. Alright, that's a much more satisfactory ending, man. At least it makes me feel better. I did shoot Strad by accident. Hopefully he's still alive. Um, anything worth 
while here. There's Stroud. We're good. Dude, what is up, Sarah? You stand up, darling. Shotgun shells. Oh, did you pick? Did you, did you, did you pick? I think we still need to go loot his body. Nothing worthwhile. Black licorice. Yeah. Oops, I didn't mean to leave that. Um. Um. Hopefully, nobody pays attention to the body in the. <laughs> in the elevator. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Fight our way out apparently. Dude, get out of the way, Walter. Look at the idiot, man. Oh my god, look at all these guys we're gonna have to complete. Well, it's a ton of XP, so... The problem is, is security gonna wanna get us when we get out of here? Um... Let's, let's go see, because I do have a quick save. Letter says, completely due to Starfield, is there romance in this game? There is. Yep. You can romance, I believe, all of the companion characters. Like, for example, I've already romanced Sarah, wherever she ran off to. Um, it's the companion I have with me right now. Thanks she is. Pretty Here she comes. So she's actually, I've actually romanced her and married her. So Maybe this is my character's wife in the game. The There's different characters, all have their own different perks. So if we were to go to my ship, look at the crew. Andreja is romanceable, and you can see her stats. Barrett's romanceable, those are his stats. What's he's good at? Heller, Lynn. I don't know about Lynn. Sam Coe's romanceable, Sarah Morgan's romanceable, Barrett's romanceable, Andreja's romanceable. I don't know. I don't know who else is romanceable off the top of my head. Perez let them. Oh, I can't fast travel from here. As long as all that stays out of the No, they cannot die. They can fall unconscious, but they can't be killed. Yep, you're welcome. Why is it pointing me back in there? I feel like that POI might be a little
Probably somebody waiting for me outside of the ship or something. Hey, no funny stuff with that booty. Captain, where are we headed next? It still says go to the ship. What's up with that? Something you might be interested in. We're at the ship. I feel like something might be bugged because of what we just did. Let's go to the cockpit. Let's take I off and see if it changes. Gold-blooded murder. There we go. Mine. I told myself I'd never cross. Do you really think we did the right thing back there? There was no other way. No time for second guesses. I can't argue with that. I'm just used to costs only being measured in money whenever I can help it. Well, I may not agree with every outcome, but you did everything to accomplish our goals and more. That's right, Well, I don't often get a chance to work in the field. So, thank you. There's a lot of sunshine and roses, buddy. Engines ready. On your word, Captain. Retro's firing. Oh, 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 here's our first encounter. You own something you have no right to. My people have killed for this. But I will offer you one chance to hand over the artifact and turn away from this path. Oh, that's not any type of ship I recognize. All right. Identify yourselves. The fact that you do not know says much. Call yourselves whatever you want. You're just thieves to me. A sentiment that is shared by my kind about you. We're not the ones making threats. Your moral grandstanding is hollow, as is your position. Make up your mind, or we will act. I'm not liking what I'm seeing on the scans. Energy output from that ship is far above the normal range. If we spin up the grab drive now, we have a chance. Full evasive maneuvers. Let's get out of here. We'll get through this. Hold on. Punch it. Woo! Oh. Now this is pod racing. Jump, please. Jump, please. Jump, please. Jump, please. Jump, please. Jump, 